Hey guys, it's Rani so for this funkies. I'm gonna be using this hearts. I do have the DIY showing you how to make them. It's pretty fun and I love them. They're actually really easy to make, but they're see-through. So for that, I'm gonna be painting them with some acrylic paint, white and black one. Ignore the Q-tips so they ended up not working for this. Instead, I ended up using this brush that I think is like for eyeshadow or just like for the crease and stuff. I never use it for that because I find it kind of pointy for like makeup, but it has like the perfect shape for this kind of thing if you don't have any brush like this feel free to work with those kind of like makeup sponges like to apply eyeshadow but i'm going to be painting the back of them having my paint towards the center and then just working my way to just fill the whole heart for the ones that are lighter i used white because it's going to be like on the background and for the dark ones i used black i'm also going to be using this really stained and old but still working phone case i've tried to uh, bring it back to clear by following a bunch of like youtube tutorials on how to remove the stain basically but like from the comments of people they've never been able to do that and that's why i paint over this one because it's already stained i'm going to be using this off white acrylic paint i do have the diy showing you how to customize this and i guess i didn't press record when i was painting this i just went with my brush giving this a few coats and then just placing my hearts and arranging them on top then i'm going to be using these two dotting tools the one on the left is just like dotting tool scribe tool type tool it's actually really handy you can use it for a bunch of different things I do have the DIY showing you how to make this and the one on the right is just another dotting tool that I also do I have a DIY for this one actually really easy to make pretty handy and in there I have some rhinestone picker I do have the DIY for this one it's actually a really old DIY so the quality is not great but it's there and it's handy I think and yeah using that to pick my little hearts and just place them exactly where I want them to be and using my other tool to just help push that glue them using my super glue this holder thingy that I have there I have a kind of like hack showing you where to find it I'm gonna be using my tool to just pick those little hearts turn them upside down place three tiny drops on the back and in some cases I ended up using my tweezers because it didn't go as smooth I guess I ended up dropping the hearts after I added the glue and so I had to use the tweezers to just pick it up and then just place it when it comes to the glue dough less is more because when you place your heart back in there if it has a lot of glue it's going to be like all over the edges I added two coats of this spray gloss using my gloves working outside but yeah guys this is the idea that I want to share with you but I wanted to mention that because of where I got this from all hearts are going to have different patterns but I think that's the cool thing about it that you can customize this and make this as different as you want it to be but again check out my other DIYs so everything makes sense I think it's really cute and hopefully you like it too and found this helpful and handy don't forget to give this video a thumbs up check out more phone cases that I have on my channel thank you so much for watching I'll talk to you later and take care bye